All right, duplicating a denture for an aligner. First, we're going to start with the denture. We're going to Vaseline the underside of the denture. Then we're going to be using Fresh and Bold silicone lap putty. About two scoops of each. So you just want to knead this until the color is uniform. All right, take off a little piece. And you really want to make sure you capture the inside of the denture. You never want to uh, pull this uh, material away from the model because so when it dries there will be voids. Right. Just bring the material up to the denture. And wait about five minutes for this to dry. All right, so once the uh, silicone putty is dried, we're going to be trimming a base around the model. And basically, uh, we want the base to be non-uniform. Uh, we want it to be um, bigger than the denture. We want it to jet out from the denture a little bit. Um, and that's about it. We do not uh, want it shiny or smooth uh, because we use the base for alignment purposes and um, that would give us um, a pretty bad alignment because we don't have any landmarks to go off of. Alright, uh, once you have that base trim, um, the uh, denture should come right off. All right, once you uh, trim the base from the denture, um, we now need to take basically an impression of the denture and the base. Um, so what we need to do is pretty much Vaseline the entire base and the denture. If you don't Vaseline the base and you put on more silicone putty that hasn't set yet, there will be a chemical reaction and they'll bond to one another. So you just want to make sure you get it really good. All right, so we're going to be using about three scoops of each. And once again, you just want to kind of knead it until the color is uniform. All right. And you want to capture the entire base. And once again, you just go ahead and wait for that to dry. All right, so once the uh, silicone putty is dried around the denture and the base of the denture, I'm going to go ahead and uh, remove both. Just uh, trim off whatever is lying on top of the base very carefully. Alright, and this should 
come right out. That's what you're left with. So these two you can send back to Ibra. You can also include the stone model if you'd like. Uh, and you can give back the denture to the patient.